Hello to my stay at home bears. Happy Tuesday. How are you guys today? Are you enjoying some of the activities we've been sending your way? We, um, we got outside for a walk and it was hot, hot, hot. We needed to cool down when we came inside, but how about you? Are you spending some time outside? I hope so, because you need to get some of that vitamin D to help your body stay healthy. But anyways, I'm coming to you today with a book. Okay, it's one of our favorites. I just thought it would be a beautiful book for us today to um, read and to encourage us to remember that we may all look different, but we're all still wonders. And then I have something to share with you in just a moment. So here we go. We're all wonders. I know I'm not an ordinary kid. Sure. I do ordinary things. I ride a bike. I eat ice cream. I play ball. I just don't look ordinary. I don't look like the other kids. He doesn't. There's something different about him, isn't there? My mom says I'm unique. She says I'm a wonder. My dog Daisy agrees. But some people don't see that I'm a wonder. All they see is how different I look. Sometimes they stare at me, they point or laugh. They even say mean things behind my back but I can hear them. That's hurtful. It hurts my feelings. And it hurts Daisy's feelings too. When that happens, I put on my helmet. I put Daisy's helmet on too. And then we... Do you remember what they do? Blast off. Blast off. Up, 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 up through the clouds across the galaxy all the way to Pluto. We say hello to old friends. Do you notice that all those old friends have one eye just like he does, because he doesn't like being different. And so he feels safer with them, doesn't he? From far away, the earth looks so small. I can't see any people there, but I know they're there. Billions of people, people of all different colors, people who walk and talk differently, people who look different like me. The earth is big enough for all kinds of people. I know I can't change the way I look, but maybe, just maybe,
people can change the way they see. And if they do, they'll see that I'm a wonder. And they'll see that they're wonders too. We're all wonders. Look with kindness and you will always find wonder. And yes, you will. And that is one of my favorite things about you, my bears, how kind you are and how you, as we like to say it in our room, see the best in others. So before I go, I have a couple letters for us from our dear friend C -c -c Cleo. Her mama dropped off something for us today. This letter says to my friends. That's you. Let's see what's inside. What did she give us? Oh my goodness, a coloring page, and who is that? I like this one, Cleo, be cool. <laughs> That's right guys, be cool, be cool. Being kind is cool, did you know that? Don't let people try to be cool by being mean. Being kind is cool. All right, and here's another one. To my friends from Cleo. What a kind heart. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'll get it open. Dun, dun, dun. Whoops. There we go. Let's see what else Cleo gave us for her friends. <laughs> Traveling north with Anna. <laughs> That's so cool, Cleo. Thank you. And then here's a little activity called Spot the Difference. Can you see the difference between this picture and this picture? Here, let me put it behind, in front of this book so the light doesn't shine through. Okay, can you see the difference between the two pictures? I'll give you just a moment. <laughs> All right, well, that's that. Thank you, Cleo, that touched my heart to get something from you today. So, alrighty bears, well that's it for today. I love you, I miss you, and I can't wait to see you again sometime soon.